Hello, Minerva? Do you read me? Over. And that's Peter Bot. It's difficult to hear you. Over. I hear you, Adabot. There's too much noise. Hello, Minerva. Come in, Minerva. Oh, I'm sorry, Adabot. Oh. There's too much noise in the signal. I couldn't hear you. I know. I couldn't hear you either. Plus, I was gonna watch a movie, but it won't play. Any idea why? Hmm. Something around here might be creating noise and interfering with the Wi-Fi signal. Noise? I don't hear any noise. Well, Adabot, sometimes there's noise that we can't hear. It's not audio noise, it's electrical noise. And it can cause problems for wireless circuits like your laptop's Wi-Fi. Or even our walkie-talkies. Noise that you can't hear? Interesting. But where could it be coming from? Lots of things can create electrical noise. But the most common are devices with motors in them. Like, say, this fan. Weird. The video still isn't loading. <sighs> noise could also come from devices that use a lot of power or send out radio waves. Or microwaves. Did I just hear the microwave oven? Oh good, my popcorn's done. And look, now that the microwave stopped, the video's loading just fine. Excellent, we are now noise free. But why does electrical noise cause problems like that? Too much electrical noise can confuse or overwhelm a circuit. Engineers often have to work on reducing electrical noise in their circuitry because less electrical noise makes a circuit work better. Oh, just like how it's hard for a person to do work when there's lots of audio noise around. Exactly. Okay, now that the Wi-Fi is working, let's try the walkie-talkies again. Okay, let's do it. you read me? Over. Loud and clear. So what was it you wanted to ask me? Over. Oh, right. Would you like to come over here and watch a movie with me? Over. <laughs> 